Now, I would like you to talk about something together for about two minutes. Here are some ways in which teenagers might benefit from developing the habit of saving money and a question for you to discuss. First, you have some time to look at the task. Now, talk to each other about how important these benefits may or may not be. Well, I, I do think it's important for teenagers to learn how to save money because in my country, many teenagers don't seem to understand, um, realize the, the value of money. Um, they use their parents as a kind of bank and don't know how hard people have to work to get to earn money. Would you agree? That's probably true, but I don't really see the point of teenagers saving money. They're a little young to worry about that. and They don't often have a lot of money anyway, so uh, I want them to enjoy themselves now, not think about the future. I don't agree with you, actually. I think teenagers should learn the value of money and how to manage their budget because they will have to do it when they grow up. Um, they need to learn that they have to save for things and set themselves financial goals. The way I see it, um, saving brings a kind of independence, which can only be a good thing. Um, the teenagers, they can feel good. They can feel, um, what's the word, uh, proud about themselves. Do you really feel that saving money would make teenagers feel good about themselves? I'm not so sure. I think they are more concerned about their their hair, their looks, uh, their friends, music, going out, uh, social networking sites. Uh, this is what they care about, not saving money. If you think about it, if they want to make their dreams come true, it's not going to happen with the little money they have saved. I don't quite follow you. Are you saying that we shouldn't encourage teenagers to save money? My brother, he's 16 and he has a little job, he works on Saturdays and uh, he saved all his money from working and bought a laptop. He saved a long time for this, he put the money in a savings account maybe for one year and now that laptop is so uh, valuable to him because he had to work hard to get it. No, no, I'm not completely against it, I just don't think it's all that important, you know. Uh, teenagers want to live in this moment, not worry about the future and saving for a later life. I think your brother is perhaps unusual. The teenagers, they, well, I don't know many teenagers, but when I was younger, when I was a teenager, and I got some money, I had to spend it straight away and enjoy myself. Thank you. Now, you have about a minute to decide which of these benefits is most important. Well, uh, uh, as I said, uh, I don't really think that any of these benefits are important for teenagers, but Katya, you mentioned about your brother, and I think it's very impressive what he did with saving for his laptop, and you say he felt uh, better about himself, so I think the best benefit is feeling good about themselves. Mm, yes, I agree to some extent, but I think uh, this one, um, setting and managing budgets, is more important because Teenagers have to learn to try and um, manage their money and how to save, which uh, bank accounts to use. And uh, also they need to learn about credit cards, how dangerous it can be uh, to spend more than you actually have. Um, you can get into debt and then have many problems. I feel strongly that this is necessary for teenagers to learn before they become adults. You can try to teach them, yes, but they might not listen. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, let's agree to differ on that one. Um, you can choose this one then, and I'll go for this one. Thank you. Can I have the booklet, please? Katya, is it more important for teenagers to save money or just enjoy the best years of their lives? Uh, to be honest, I think most teenagers already know how to enjoy themselves 
And a lot of them are very selfish. Um, they think they can go any time to their parents and ask for money, and this makes them lazy. Um, they can get what they want straight away, and this can make them a little bit, um, how can I put it, uh, spoiled. So I think they should learn how to save and wait for things they want, and this will um, they will hopefully not, when they're adults, get into too much debt and use credit cards too much. Um, nowadays, people seem to think they can buy whatever they want on their credit card. It's very easy. And the difficult, is, uh, the difficult part is when they have to pay it all back. So many people get into debt, and it's very hard to get out of. And teenagers have to understand this. And what do you think, Aldo? As I said before, I think uh, teenagers should enjoy the best years of their lives, absolutely. When they grow up, they have enough problems in front of them, so while they are young, they should have fun and not worry about finances. If they don't get money from their parents, they can work. I'm not saying teenagers should be lazy, but I don't agree with Katya that it is selfish. When you are a teenager, you can be a little bit selfish, it's normal. Do you think that financial responsibility should be limited to adults, Aldo? Uh, financial... Responsibility? Do you think that financial responsibility should be limited to adults? Uh, yes. Yes. Uh, generally, yes. Uh, adults are earning money for the family, so they should make the decisions about how to spend it. Teenagers can't earn as much as adults, so I don't believe they can take... Um, take responsibility for the family budget. Do you agree, Katya? Yes, I, I partly agree with Aldo that teenagers usually work part-time and they receive uh, low pay, so they don't, um, you know, they don't earn a lot of money and can't take financial responsibility. However, if the family has a low income, um, it can help very much if teenagers get um, part-time jobs and can pay for some of their expenses themselves, like um, clothes or their mobile phone, for example. Um, this can really help the family. It's been said that setting and managing a budget can be of benefit to a teenager. Do you agree? Yes, uh, I've already said that I totally agree with the statement. Um, it's good for teenagers to have goals for spending, otherwise they uh, waste money on things which are not necessary. And how about you, Aldo? As I said, I, I don't see it as very important because teenagers have a very small budget anyway. They might only get pocket money or that um, maybe a very low wage, and so it's not really worth managing. Some people believe that parents should tell their teenagers about uh, the household budget and should teach them about the cost of living. What do you think? Uh, yes, if they will listen. <laughs> of course it is a good idea if teenagers know how much things cost, but they might not be interested. I don't know many teenagers... I know that they are not aware of how much time it takes to earn money to pay for things. And it could be good if parents take their children to see where, where they work and so they can see it for themselves, what is hard, what hard work is. I remember when I was a teenager, I wasn't interested in the cost of things really, except for music downloads and maybe clothes. Uh, and what do you think, Katia? Uh, I completely agree that parents should tell teenagers about uh, household costs. Uh, when I was a child, uh, I used to go shopping uh, to the supermarket with my mom, and we would uh, play a, a kind of guessing game of how much the total bill would be, and the winner was the person who guessed correctly. So this game made me look at the price of everything. Um, I want to say that uh, I think that teenagers should learn about managing money at school, uh, they could learn things about how to open a bank account, how to set up a direct debit, uh, how to pay bills, or how to get cheaper services from gas or electricity companies. Uh, then they would feel happier and confident, more confident about uh, dealing with money and running a household. 
Oh, I'm happy we didn't study that at school. <laughs> I think, I mean, I understand what you are saying, but it would be very boring, you know, to learn this at school. People can learn how to open a bank account and pay bills without studying it as a subject. Everybody manages somehow. Well, yes, they, they manage, but uh, don't you think they, uh, they could find it easier if they had learned about it at school? Thank you. That's the end of the test. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Goodbye. Thank you. Goodbye. Bye-bye.